Okay, I'm going to uh, show you how I play the Beatles Get Back. So I just want to uh, stress right out front, this is not technically the correct way to play it. It's uh, obviously not an acoustic song. Uh, and George plays, you know, A chords up on, up on the fifth fret and so forth. Um, I'm just going to show you the way I choose to play it solo uh, on an acoustic guitar. Okay, now it's an A chord and it's pretty much... Uh, just doing little downstrokes on, on the sort of the middle strings. I, I just bar completely across the top four strings, but when I'm doing the, the main riff, I'm pretty much just hitting the five, four, and three strings. And I'm going on and off the fourth string on the um, fourth fret. Just down strokes, and I'm also palm muting. I'm using inside of my palm to mute um, after each sort of down stroke. And you just release it. So just practice that for a while. Use, if you prefer to use your pinky, then your fourth finger, um, whatever. Whatever is easiest to reach for you. Just down strokes. Down, 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 down. D chord now, but you're going to use your pinky to come up onto the third string, fourth fret, on and off. You don't necessarily have to strum right down to the first string, you can just sort of strum the fourth, third, and second strings if you like. It's easier just to fret the whole D, I find anyway, but um, if you want to just fret the D sus too, do that as well. Whatever's easiest for you. Just makes sense to me to just make a D and use my pinky on the fourth. Uh, fret of the third string. playing it acoustic, this sounds perfectly fine and it's a lot easier. So it's just a few different little techniques to make up the song. You just need that little riff on the A, the little riff on the D. All I'm doing here is making a D chord and I'm playing three, one, and I'm releasing the three and the one strings and playing them open. Three, one, and then just strumming a D on the fourth string. So three, one, three, one, D. So get back. Bits together. I know it looks 
looks easy as said than done but literally just master those little four bits just keep playing them over and over and over again get some muscle memory happening and you'll find it'll all um, come together um, just with a bit of practice but you know as I said that's just the way I choose to play it you know people will come and correct me that's not the way the Beatles do it duh of course doesn't matter it's the way I do it if you like it go ahead and play it that way if you don't go watch another tutorial as always all right guys see ya thanks